How's it going everyone? Daxels here and today we're going to be reacting to another video game donkey video reacting to Animal Crossing New Horizon. Let's get straight into it. And away we go. I think in all my years of talking about video games, the thing I tend to come down on the hardest is when games take shallow gameplay and stretch it very thin over a lengthy duration. Yeah. Many games, good and bad, are guilty of this. Death sure. Stranding, Skyrim, <laughs> Shenmue, Red Dead, Final Fantasy, Pokemon, yep. and Animal Crossing. These are 60 plus hour games that can be mastered in the first two hours of playing. The Actually difference true. is, if I talk shit about Animal Crossing, Leah will shoot me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, he's been holding ransom. That makes sense. Animal it's okay, Frost dude. is very upfront about what type of game it is. You build a bridge for animals to go across. It's, it's right there in the title. Unlike every game I listed, there is no combat. There is no dramatic high stakes story because Animal Crossing <laughs> is very cool and relaxed. Most games you're blowing up dragons <laughs> with a rocket launcher. Here, I'm fishing. Other game, you're shooting machine guns at Tony Hawk's spaceship. Let's go. I'm popping a balloon with slingshot. <laughs> It isn't the first ever game to feature slower, more tranquil pacing, but it does commit to this idea much further than other games are willing to, often making you wait real-time days, weeks, or months even for things to transpire. Wow. With an ultra slow burning I kinda hate that. like this, it's important to gain trust from the player, faith that their patience will be rewarded and not just completely pissed on like in an MMO. The genius okay, of Animal true. Cross is in its sense of progression. It has a very visual way of showing you how far you've come. When you first start off, your island is pretty barren. Little river, some trees, and only a couple of animals scattered around the map. You sleep in this dinky tent with a <laughs> crappy radio that sounds like a car <laughs> ran over it. No electricity, no running water. This place is a total shithole, but you come back the next day and what's this? Oh, now you got a new tool. And you got some new yeah. items in the store. You got a couple quests. That when this game first money. come out, it's very devious. It was everywhere. To keep you coming back. Slowly, your island becomes populated with more and more wacky villagers as you landscape the town and decorate it with your treasure chest of items. Check out my man cave room. Jeez. This is where Godzilla goes. Now this is my bathroom. Oh, that's a good deal. This is where you go pee pee. This is the main hall. This is where I come up with all my incredible ideas for videos i'm thinking about doing a funny cheeto video the animals are cartoony and expressive except for tortimer but the furniture is realistic kind of reminiscent of pikmin's art style now grizz you're gonna like this this is actually the typewriter from the shining uh, I'd rather have soccer ball. This is a collective <laughs> I'd on a ball. massive scale. The more stuff you get, the cooler you are. You gotta get all the fish, all the bugs, all the fossils, all the items. Only then will they respect you. Save me. Somebody He's running from a spider? <laughs> oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, no, no. <gasps> oh. Gotcha. Nicely done. The drum machine sound of the older games is gone, but their funky offbeat spirit lives on. You even have two remix soundtracks for when it rains or snows. She. Every part of the game is just she. laid back attitude, except when you start going for the rare fish. This is where Animal Cross turns into the Neo 2 Hitler's Hell expansion pack. Okay. Neo 2. Whoa, sea bass. I didn't know they had sea bass in this game. <laughs> oh my god. Oh no. That's ridiculous. Okay. Yo. We'll put him right there. One day at okay. 4 p.m. I decided that I wanted to catch the string fish. So I walk around his spawn for about 20 minutes until I see an abnormally large shadow of a fish. Yum. And he's gone. Oh. Then I get another chance. Okay. Oh. About an gone. hour later, that's <gasps> when I realized I'm hitting a button too slow. This is too fast. disgusting. I'm getting angry. <laughs> I am wanting to unlock the gun tool now. 740. The string fish, I hate him. 813. I hand the controller to Leah. No. No. Are you kidding me? That's... That's hilarious. Okay. Oh, <laughs> if there's one obvious thing missing from Animal Crossing, it's the ability to craft more than one thing at a time. 
and also mini games. I feel like this is the perfect mm -hmm. type of game to cram a bunch mm. of mini games into. If you do good, you get <laughs> prizes or bells. Come on, that 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 would be cool. Way to go, man. <laughs> nah, I'm not that good. Blathers is obviously the greatest character. He's my favorite because not only does he hate bugs, but whenever you bring him something new for the museum, he gives you this funny little rundown. But let's not forget Coach and Roll. All they do is talk about protein shakes and getting ripped. Yet every time I see them, they are sitting under a tree eating a sandwich. Like, watch, let's go talk to Roll. Yeah, I'm a war hero. No, you aren't. You're like four years old. Animal Crossing <laughs> is a bizarre game to rate because you can't experience everything it has to offer in a couple weeks of playing. Still, uh, I think it's safe okay. to say this will go down as one of Nintendo's best games of the Switch era. I give it a four. Damn. I need a five out of five. <laughs> uh, good video. Good video. I enjoyed that. I enjoyed that very much. Very good, very good. Okay, everyone, that is the end of the video. If you enjoyed that video, make sure you check out the original description down below. If you enjoyed this video, hit the thumbs up. Comment, would you like me to react to next? Subscribe if you're new or just haven't yet. I'll be seeing you in the next video. Later.